What's going on, y'all? This is Kyle Cairo. Um, first and foremost, big thank you to AJ and Sammy. Really love what you guys are doing. Um, just allowing believers an opportunity to share an aspect of their faith. And with that being said, the area that I want to share is regarding consistency or consistently seeking after the Lord. Uh, they describe David as a man who was after God's own heart. The benefit that I've experienced when I strive to do this is that I found that God will seek you out in response. For example, I just got back from New Orleans in which I was just trying to go for a vacation. Um, I didn't have an itinerary or a schedule. I figured maybe I'd try some food or listen to some jazz music. Yet, I found myself in a room full of believers sharing my testimony in front of everybody. And during that trip is probably when I felt God's presence like never before. And some may describe that as a coincidence and that's, that's fine, but I feel as though it was God seeking after me to further develop me. Um, the part about development I think is an important one. In fact, the verse that's been on my heart as of late is Philippians 1, 6. He who has started a good work in you will see it through to completion. And to me, you know, the process of furthering your relationship with Christ, um, making yourself more like him is what it's all about. In fact, it says in 2 Corinthians 5, 17, that therefore, if anybody is in Christ, they are a new creation. Old things are gone and the new is here. I come back to these verses, especially when I'm struggling in my walk or I've been inconsistent. They remind me that although I'm not there yet, I'm no longer bound to, you know, my sinful nature. Even better than that, I've also experienced God seeking me out of the darkness because not only am I his creation, made in his image, but he isn't done with me and has a purpose for my life in his kingdom. So again, I just want to encourage you all that we could further our walk with the Lord by seeking him out consistently, you know, working to establish a relationship with him and understanding his ways, wisdom, discipline, and love. So thanks.